Check out this gorgeous ombre look. I did all 10 nails in less than 10 minutes. Yeah, that's right. No more wasting your time with all those old fashioned techniques. First things first, we need to prep our air ombre bottle. All you have to do is twist it, turn it and spray it just like I do here. Make sure to spray over a trash can so you don't get your work area dirty. Always make sure that there's a steady stream of powder before starting the application. Link to all the colors used in this video will be in the description below. Next, we will need Gel Star UV Healthy Gel Base and UV Gel Top. We will start out by setting our UV LED Hybrid SNS Lamp to 30 seconds. I've already prepped my nails, but if you haven't, this is the time to do so. I'm going to start by applying Gel Star Base Coat and make sure to always keep an even layer always avoid the cuticle line. I'm going to start with one of my air ombre bottles. Start spraying at the cuticle line going down the nail. Press the pump lightly in small bursts. A little goes a long way. Now for the other side. If you see small areas that are not covered by the color, go over them again. Now turn on your UV lamp and cure for 30 seconds. One more layer of UV Gel Star Base. Again, make sure that it's an even coat. One more layer of Air Ombre. Now let's reverse the colors of order. Start with the color you finished off with first. Spray from the cuticle line all the way to the edge of the nail. Follow up with the second color. And cure for 30 seconds. Once it's completely cured, dust off the nail and make sure to get underneath it too. It's time for our UV gel top coat. Apply over the whole nail. Now, let's put it in there for 60 seconds. All we're doing now is completing the same process on the rest of the nails. Now that our vertical ombre is complete, it's time for the drip effect. I'm using UV Healthy Gel Star color 131 and 65. I'm going to use this little tool and apply Gel Star 65. 
Using the larger edge of the tool, I'm going to apply a small amount at the cuticle line. Spread along the line, but don't get it on the cuticles. Now just follow the same pattern I'm doing here. Cure it for 30 seconds. Now that you know that it's completely dry, it's time for the droplet effect. For the droplet effect to look realistic, we're going to use a small brush. I'm going to apply Gelstar 131. Now use a small amount and apply to the left side of the droplets. This will give it a glistening effect like you see in water. Now cure for another 30 seconds and you're all set. Look at those beautiful nails. Thank you so much for tuning in and let us know if you have any questions in the comments below. Please like and subscribe if you enjoyed this video. Hit the bell notification for the easiest and fastest tutorials. Comment below and let us know what you'd like to see next. Bye for now!